All right, one more video. Let's go ahead and go downstairs because we're going to the garage, I guess. I mean, we could go and look around the house, but that makes me nervous because I don't want to run into any scary Doesn't Nazi look like people. The Price family is rolling in dough these days. Oop. Well, okay. I guess we're looking at their uh, their nope. mail now. Someone locked it from the other side. Probably for the best. We're totally not Kate. Thanks again, Max, for helping me. No problem. That guy is an asshole. Well, I hope that really doesn't get me killed. Also, I know I said I would totally read that um, at some point. I will, I promise. Travel money. I'd love to go to Paris, too. At this rate, they'll be lucky to get to Portland. Can we put some money in there? Vote, look. Joy still works at Two Wheels Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Yes, we should. Toilet paper. All right then. It's pretty normal I family seen stuff. This place in five years. I'm sure. It seems like forever. Well, you didn't keep up apparently, so you know. Is this the way to the garage? Is this, is this how I find the garage? It's been five years since I've been here. I can feel autumn pushing out the summer. It's the best part of October, if you ask me, little lady. Is this a garage? Apparently not. Swing? I can swing. <gasps> I can sit on the swing. What do you and it really breaks. Want to do when you grow up? Oh, are we remembering Max, something? I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world. Go far from here. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Uh, dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. <laughs> She's so tiny. I would be like Lara Croft, except real. That would be majorly cool. Oh, this is sad. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us. This is making me feel. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love to be a photographer. And the creepy bird swarm. Could be. Could we take a picture of what that bird swarm? About? Cause it's creepy. Max, you are a photographer. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. Do they put the photographs in museums? I, I don't actually know. It feels like they should be somewhere else. That music though is really pretty. Can we just talk about that for like a minute? A grave. We made this grave for Chloe's kitty. Poor Bongo. He never saw that car coming. I believe it. I don't know what I'd do if my cat got hit by a car. I'd really, really suck. Anyways. Let's go this way. Why do we want to look at this couch? A picture. Right, well, I let's go in here. To find the tools I need here. Uh, I really hope we don't get in trouble. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. Oh, no. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? He's this guy? How paranoid can you get? Oh no. Crap. We're so dead. Chloe's I didn't. My stepdad is a veteran and a security guard. He must really hate her. Oh my god. We are doomed. We are. Oh my god. There's a gun rack. We're not doing. We're not touching the gun rack. Nope. Oh, he has a target. Yes. Score. Score? I don't know if we want to be happy about that because I'm pretty sure that's the security guard that we pissed off. Well, this actually will have consequences. What? Wait, what do you mean it will have consequences? No, 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 wait. I I don't like that. I'm well, going to get in trouble for map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. I feel like I should know this placement of cameras. Switch on. I mean, if we're going, we're going in all the way. Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? That is really creepy. We should, we should close this. Clo clo close, close the cupboard. Close it. Oh, man. Okay, Don't let's use these tools. Day. I need tiny tools for that camera. Tiny tools. Right, not using that. I have already dug myself a grave. I am afraid to touch anything. Files! Oh man. I don't like this. Can I not be here? Like, this really seems not okay to be 
Nothing. This is so lame. Oh boy, I'm gonna get killed. I'm gonna get killed. That's what's gonna happen. I'm totally gonna get Look killed. I'm gonna get food. totally killed. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. A car? Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. I, I wonder what told you that. The car or all of the stuff in here that does stuff. Like all the tools and crap. Is there nothing else in here? Oh my god. I don't want to open any more of the cupboards. That one had consequences. That makes me really nervous. This actually will have consequences. It's food. Great. I don't think there are any tools that we can use in here, kiddo. We really should, like, leave or something. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. Yeah, I know, and I'm pretty he sure that- surveillance cameras all over the school? A blue plank? How paranoid can you get? We- can, What do we do with the blue plank? Can I- Apparently there was something I could do with this strange blue plank. No, nothing. A door. Can I open this door? Cool. Now it's open. I'm now I've made a shortcut. Welcome to Bloodborne. Well, there are no tiny tools, or am I losing my mind? Like I've looked at everything, right? Right, and I'm eighty percent sure that there are no tiny tools in here. I guess we'll go back to Chloe and be like, "Hey, there are no tools." No need to go there now. Oh, apparently not. I'm just missing it. Which is normal. I don't want to look at those files. I don't want to touch those. That just screams I'm going to get in so much trouble. I'm not touching the gun rack because that also screams getting in so much trouble. And we just... Ugh. There are no tools! What are we looking for? I, I don't understand. I don't understand. No, I'm not playing their answering machine. I'm not very good at, like, curiosity games where it's like, here's all of this stuff that you should totally look at. And I'm like, uh, no. I guess we're going to use his laptop. No like it would help me find tools anyway. Not David. Unlock. Okay. Well, anyways. Let's totally leave this computer alone and not touch that or anything. Can we talk about the fact that there are no tools in here? Uh oh. Ooh, I'm just dumb. Precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. So if we turn this on, it'll knock them over, won't it? Yep. Handled. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Okay. Well, we can use this. Right? Man, I should have done that before they fell. Oh. Well. Here we go. And there we go. Perfect. Skip. No, 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 wait. No, go back. Where was that speed up button? Nope, not that. Okay, so those are still up there, so now we can push this. <laughs> I love how this is just a normal thing now. Time can throw back time. Cool, let's just do that. She could have still put that underneath them or something and like totally MacGyvered that out of there. Haha, -ha! skills. And now let's turn it off because we don't want to leave that on. It's a total waste of power and stuff. Okay, so let's pull that out, and now we got tools. Yes. You have mad skills, Max. One might say you are a Mad Max or something. So now I guess we go back. I got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Before Chloe freaks? She wanted to be alone. Why would she freak out? She wanted you to leave her alone. Now let's not actually snoop anywhere, please. Let's just totally go in here. Find Chloe. Now we can fix our camera and everything is right with the world. Hi! You found, found the, tools. the tools. Sweet. Oh, that you was You can weird. sit at my desk and fix your camera. Why, thank you, Chloe. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? 
In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. Mad Max. I was there. I was I'm there, gonna just tell the truth. Hiding in the corner. Damn, you are a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. I know there we I go. look a lot different. I was scared too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't believe ah, that that explains it. <clears throat> like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Like who? Like who? Like anybody. Stop stalling, sister. The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk yes. jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Yeah, I well, I've learned that now. At all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Thanks. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. Yes. I like your tats, by the way. They're hella cool. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. You're gonna That's give so me his cool camera? You remembered my birthday, but I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. I believe take it. Pony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> All right, then I'm going to take a picture of her. Okay, go forward. Photo. Stop shaking your pictures. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. No, I can't dance. I actually can't. Yes, <laughs> there down, we go. Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. <laughs> Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Oh boy. What's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Well, Handy, there is a I'm coming. What are you doing? I'm hiding. Chloe, I'm hiding. Stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let well, me Well, that in. didn't work. Now. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. <laughs> I'm not screwing around, soldier. Okay, let's do the window. Open this, door. this is going nowhere fast. I better look someplace else. Hide under the bed? You. I can't hide under the bed. Where else? Okay, hang on, hang on. I'm gonna scroll this back. Door. Okay, where can I hide? I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open the door. There's like nowhere One, to hide. Two, three. Okay, we're going all the way back. Okay, wait. Okay, can we try that again? I'm Move. changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. There we go. Let me in. Now we can hide in the can in, the, in the closet. Stuck. Okay, now we're in here. Around, soldier. Chloe. soldier? Did you just call her slow soldier? What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat. We'll do that to you. Oh boy, here we go. One of my guns is missing. I didn't touch it. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Stay hidden. 
I don't want to get involved. Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon. Hey, leave Joyce out of this. I wish you'd leave Joyce, like now. <gasps> oh, jeez. Chloe, I'm sorry. I care about your mother, and you just keep pushing me. And that makes it okay. Don't touch me again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast. You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Hey, you okay? Welcome to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? I should have jumped would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. This Dana action was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? With this one, I don't see that helping at all. Anyways, I'm going to end this episode here. If you guys disagree with my actions, let me know because I can do it again or something. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and I will see you next time. See you guys later.